Cheers, Roy. Uh, excuse me, has Peter Barlow been in here? Uh, no. Who's asking? Uh, never mind. Well, I'm Peter's son. Right, I see. So, what do you want? Um, well, it's a, it's a sensitive matter. C can I get you anything? Uh, macchiato. <laughs> Afraid not. Right, forget it. Okay. Right, well, if, you, if you'll excuse me, I, I have plant-based sausages to attend to. So, what do you want my dad for? You really don't have to concern yourself. <laughs> well, if it's to do with my dad, then yeah, I do. Well, your dad is late. We're meant to be finishing up on a deal. Henry Thorne. And your name is? Simon. Right, well, Simon, perhaps you could do your dad a favour and tell him that if he doesn't turn up here in the next five minutes, the deal's off. Is this about that dictaphone? What do you know about that? Have you got the money? Look, I really don't get it. Your dad called to accept my offer, told me to meet him here, and then he goes, hey, well, I seriously don't have time for this, so, look, just tell him the deal's off. Oh, well, wait a minute. The fifth message I've left you. Look, I've given him your bank details and he said he's ready to go, so can you please call me back now? Right, that's the account number and sort code in. Have the dictaphone, please. Oh, don't mess me around, either you and your dad want the money or you don't. Nope. Right, looks like we're done here then. I want to see you transfer it first. That's not how this works. Well, it's how it works for me. All right. You the dictaphone? Do one, will you? Oh, no, was I going to say how nice it was to have met you and drawn a line under this little problem? <laughs> 